Hello and welcome back to the Chill Crew. So, we are still pretty much doing what we were doing last episode. We're building up, we're leeching off of this guy, and we're building tall. And things might not seem like they're expanding very quickly, and I want to say why this is perfectly okay. Essentially, this generation of our uh, playthrough is not going to do an awful lot. We never expected it to do very much, and it shouldn't do very much. We're a single province count right down here. But, what we're doing is we're building up things. Like this guy. His child is going to inherit claims. Probably. But he has a claim on something? Oh, he has, a he, has an, yeah, he has an implicit claim on our stuff because he's our child. Yeah, anyway. So yeah, his children are probably going to get claims. At the very least, his wife is going to get a claim. So there's something going on there. Look at the next sibling. We betrothed them over to somebody over here. We're going to get more claims passing down. And basically, this is what I'm saying. We're going to get more and more claims and more and more opportunities. And as we keep playing, we're going to become naturally stronger. We're going to have a good income. We're going to have a good number of troops to help if they happen to get into a war that we need to assist them with. We're going to have a good amount of um, resources to push towards whatever objective we're after. And then, um, eventually, once we get to the next stage up... Like, say we become a duke, we're suddenly going to become very, very strong and be able to just very, very quickly do what we want to do. So, it, I think it's a snowball effect that we're going for here. Anyway, as I'm saying that, uh, who are we trying to... We're trying to kill this guy. Yes, so that will then uh, pass things down. Wait, why, why are we trying to kill this one in particular? Now I'm looking at this and I'm like, why do we want to kill this guy? This seems incorrect. Surely I should want to kill his children. Because killing this guy doesn't actually get us anything in particular. Yeah, I think we want to actually kill his children. I think that would make more sense. Because if we kill him, then that's only going to pass down his claim. I mean, it's going to pass down his claims to his children here. But we would ideally just like it to go directly to our, um, to our son, if that's possible. Yeah, I think I'd prefer to kill him. What's our chance? 13%? Okay, what's our chance currently on this murder him guy? 13%. Yeah, I think I might switch it up. I think I might try and kill him or kill his children. Actually, that could be a good idea as well. If we can keep his children dead and his children dead, then eventually it will still pass down into our family, even if we have to wait a generation for it to jump back up. Yeah, potentially. Could also try killing his other son. 38% on that one. And then his grandson? 13. Let's try killing his other son. Sure. That way, at least, there's only one other potential line that things are going down. Yeah, start a scheme. Right. Anybody interested? Uh, anybody? No. Zero characters will join me. Well, that's fine. We'll see where we can get to. Right. Uh, I think we're just going to unpause now and let things go. There's not a lot that we need to worry about. We are in some wars, but, I mean, it's not like these are wars we can do anything about. We're just kind of in them. It's like, yeah. What are we going to do? They have huge numbers of troops and... We do not. So, I think I'm just going to unpause and let things go. Okay. Uh, you ha In your work in this court, you have failed to find any secrets his wife might possess. Okay. Get out of here. Right, there we go. His wife might uh, possess. So, do we want anything on his wife? She's got 15 gold. I'm trying to think if there's anything else we'd want here. I really want the one on uh, him himself. Having a hook on his wife... I'm trying to think what that would even do for us. I don't think that's... Yeah, I don't think that's worthwhile right now. We'll just get the opinion. Yeah. A lot of these are like, I'll just get the opinion. Right now, we don't need to worry about it. We're not worried about having to make any big plays. Just let things happen. So we lost some prestige here. That's absolutely fine. We failed to find any secrets his wife has. Well, we'll get another 30 opinion for that. Actually, that's a good thing to check. Does that actually give 30 or is that... Wait, did we not get 30 opinion... Maybe it was a different person. Maybe I'm crazy. I'm fairly certain that said we should get 30 opinion. Ah, whatever. Then on comes of age. I'm proud to see um, that my son is no longer a child. Uh, see my son no longer as a child, but as an adult. Okay. So, uh, let me just wait a second. He now is a ton of marshal. I think we want to marry him off. Let's find somebody. Uh, so we're looking for... Let's go alliance power. There are no alliances. Wonderful. I guess we'll just stick with relevance. Uh, so I'm looking for any of you who actually have... Like, relations who have claims. So you have a claim on Sherbo over here. Not necessarily anything we can do with that. Hmm. 
Actually, yeah, it doesn't look like many people have claims. I have considered switching religion. Maybe that would help us. If we switch to the religion that's big one, the, um... Is that the right religion tab? Faiths. Yeah, if we switch to the big one over here, that might actually be a lot better for us. Because then we can... Like, if we switch to this one right here, then we can potentially start uh, getting better marriages in this land. Yeah, I think I might switch to this guy's religion. Sure. How much does it cost me? Nothing. Okay. What's his religion like? Adaptive? So, uh, let me just check what we've got, whether there's anything we want to keep. Adaptive. Infidel vassals are less likely to join independence. Doesn't really matter. Uh, county conversion resistance is up. You get level of splendor for newborns going up. Level of splendor for getting married. All of that's pretty good. Yeah, I like that. Uh, building construction goes up. Yeah, that's the reason I was holding off. But I actually think I might still do it. Right, and then if we have a look at us here. We lose this one. We lose the ability to seek the aid of the spirits. Um, and then we lose ritual celebrations. Okay. Yeah, I think we're in. I think we're, I think we're just going to switch faith. Cool. Uh, I would like to convert to his faith. My close family will convert. Zero out of zero vassals will convert. Uh, my old faith will consider me hostile. Sure, I'm in. Uh, we have a new person in charge uh, in charge here in terms of uh, being in this role. A Hogan. Uh, oh, also, does this faith have like a... No, it doesn't have a current head of faith or anything. Okay, cool. That's fine. So, uh, oh, let me double check other things with it. I think we're now allowed concubines, right? Uh, oh no, polygamous marriage. Okay, cool. So, uh, that's interesting. We could potentially do something with that. So yeah, we can get some secondary spouses if we wanted to. I don't particularly have anyone right now who I want to be a secondary spouse, but it's interesting. Right, and now we might be able to get some better marriages here. Genius! Ooh, that was a great one if we can get that in the family. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna take that. We'll get genius. We'll accept plus five. Fantastic. So we just got that probably because we switched our um because we switched our religion. That's it. Yeah. So if we let that one go through. So now married. She's just a lowborn person. That's fine. Wonderful. Okay. Well, that's good. So now we have a uh, another one. And this one's effectively gonna just be a uh, hope that we get genius in our family kind of thing. And uh I wanted to go back to our religion, I believe. That Cousin marriage is fine. Okay, so we could potentially do something with that. Maybe. We'll see. What's this one got going for us? Too few spouses. Um, you should marry to negate the presti uh, prestige penalty. Did it say? Uh, or was it piety? Uh, piety penalty you're currently suffering. I'm not suffering any. Guess I'll wait till the end of the month and then see. Am I suffering a piety penalty? Doesn't seem like it. Alright, sure. Um, we could get secondary spouses. I just don't entirely know what the purpose is going to be for us to get them. Like, we don't really need the, uh, children. We have quite a few, so. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. We'll let that keep rolling. And now our, um, what should be nice is our Lee should like us better. Uh, not necessarily. Hmm, interesting. Uh, you're trying to find secrets on the Spy Master. So this is Caddy should gain 30 opinion of me. Does she already have any opinion? She's grateful. So what's this one called? This one's this, this one's called grateful. So this should push it back up to 30? Yeah, so this just pushes it back up to 30. Cool. That's all right. Barely used trail. One of my agents is preparing a special trip for young Luigon. The child trusts he will be brought on an enjoyable day in the forest. Luigon will unfortunately get lost, be impossible to find before nightfall. Oh, it was so young too. So I can get a 38% chance he's killed and a 47% chance it's discovered. I think we uh, don't attempt the murder. I think we have to just hope that we get a good event to help us at some point. That's the one I'm looking for. I think a job done right should be good though. Hostile scheme success chance. That should help us with our murder. Potentially. Yeah, let's grab it. So now if we have a look. Now we're at 63. 63 is a much better dice roll than 38. Obviously. But I just thought I'd say it anyway. A notable guest has arrived. You're a trained healer. We don't really need a trained healer. I think we're fine. Oh, how much do our buildings cost now? Uh, you're trying to find secrets on his steward. Yeah, not interested. Um, yeah, how much do our buildings cost? So, is this still building? Yeah, it's still building. Uh, 82 now. 
That's not too bad. So we should have enough for the next building by the time that we finish the current one. Oh, we're obese. Apparently. Alright. There wasn't really any lead up to that. It's just like, you're obese now. Okay then. Well, I guess we hit 40 and then that was it. We're, we're obese. Looks like we might die soon, which isn't great. It's come to my attention, my lord, that you might be in need of someone of my talents. My new acquaintance, Nyonwe, approaches me, smiling. My services could be of use. Please do not hesitate to request them. So she can uh, join our court for 20 opinion, or you're not the woman for the job. 23 intrigue? I mean, come along. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with you, but that's quite a lot of intrigue. We could put you in as our spy master, I suppose. Who's our current guy? Some random? Yeah. Okay. We'll place you with some other random. There we go. We will definitely... Oh, right. She just becomes a guest. We still have to pay to employ her. That's fine. I will do. Alright, we'll assign her. Yep. So she's very good. And then potentially... We could actually get her to support our schemes. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to change her to support schemes. Oh, it just... Alright. It just supports the schemes. You don't have to be like, choose an area. Hey, your sparring grounds are complete. So we should have so, a few more troops now. Yeah, maximum of 320. Wow. But now we're at 79% chance of murdering this child. There we go. Now, a 79% chance, but there's only a 6% chance the scheme is discovered. That's great. So that means there's a 94% chance that nothing bad happens. And there's a 79% chance that something good happens. Yeah, I think we'll take that. Luagon is dead. The search went long into the night before it was called off and reconvened at dawn. It was only then the body was found bloodied, mangled, and torn after an attack by some vicious, hungry beast. At least, I hope it was a beast doing. Thankfully, everyone agrees it was a terrible tragedy and my involvement and the existence of any scheme remains unknown. And they say children are the future. Uh, I gain 40 stress for killing him. However, I also lose 14 because I'm sadistic. Oh, well that's good. So, uh, one child down. Just want to have a look at the air. Uh, third one in line. Uh -huh. We're getting there. This child. Murder. 54%. I'll take that. I'll take those odds. Um, and a 69% of secrecy. So it's 31% chance we'd be discovered. Okay. This is looking good. I think we're doing well with this one. Oh, does anyone want to join? Not really. But that's alright. With our uh, intrigue focus, we don't need other people. We can just do it ourselves. Although I am interested in whether you could get people to join your abduction, abduct them, and then just execute them. Which could be fun. Concerned courtiers. And how long before he is plotting against us? This scheming is getting out of hand. Za o -lo, uh, and Bindu are standing with their heads close together, and they s startle as I round the corner. My Farron, we were just talking about your recreational activities. They seem to take up so much of your time. Bindu being the person who's married to my son. Yes. Hmm. Okay. Um, so we could say nothing that any loyal servant should worry about and get our intrigue lifestyle experience. We can try and reassure them and get less experience or mind your own business. I'll take the 100 intrigue lifestyle experience because that's by far the best option. Like, even on the good rolls? I'm very confused about that one. Murder. En route. When the time comes, my agents will need a safe escape route out of Nana Caplea's uh, castle should anything go wrong. A detailed map of the local jungle with all of its hidden paths and caves would be an invaluable resource. So I can pay someone to draw one. Uh, there's a chance that the mur murder scheme gains Tattletail, which lowers the secrecy. But there's also a higher chance that... Uh, oh, we but we get mapped surroundings no matter what. Okay, so actually that means that our success chance goes up by 10 no matter what. But it can also go down 20 in secrecy. But up 10 in secrecy, so it's only down 10 in secrecy. Spoil the jungle myself seems terrible. Or abandon the idea. I'm just going to pay him. Yeah. It gained Tattletail, but it also... Yeah, should have gained some extra success. So yeah, so that's now got... Map surroundings plus 10. Yeah, map surroundings plus 10 in there as well. That's kind of weird as an event then. The Critter. 
A wide variety of venomous cre uh, critters greet me at a merchant stall. I'm struck with my inspiration. Wouldn't one of these exquisite creatures be the perfect gift for Togar? So, we have a 64% chance of success and a 31% chance of being caught. Oh, wait, we could say, give me that snake for studies and we get learning, or he will never see it coming and it just says no immediate effects. You know what, I'll just get the uh, plus one uh, learning for that one. That's okay. What's this? So, this is uh, Yatenga calling us to war. They are attacking these guys. Go for it. I'm in. Wish you luck. They have more troops, so it's fine. Uh, so we got the rarely used trail. We can have them go on a hunting trip. A nice uh, toddler hunting trip. Um, hmm. So a 31% chance is low, but I think I'm going to rethink it. I'd like to be above 70, I think, before I try it. I think, yeah. I would really like to be above 70, though, if that's at all possible. The comfort of a friend. My friend has lowered my stress by 54. Oh, that's fantastic. We're now not stressed enough that we can murder another child. Wonderful. That's what I like to see. Do you want to do this one again? No. We'll wait for that to come back down. Betrothal fulfilled. Uh, Bintu Fing and uh, 4K are now married. Fantastic. So... This is the person whose war we're now in. That's uh, their child. That's cool. Okay. Barely used trail. Mm, nope. I think we'll uh, wait for another event if that's possible. Scheme discovered? What do you mean, scheme discovered? Oh, you haven't. Oh, you didn't discover that I was doing it. You just discovered that the scheme exists. Alright, we'll kill that one then. Right. Father. Father will now be murdered. Uh, ooh, we can convince Janjay with a bribe. Wouldn't need to pay 13. Okay, that gets somebody else in here. Oh, we're now at 95%. Well, that'll work well. How long till he's dead? Nine months. Okay, cool. That's what I like to see. Wait, who is Janjay? It's the spy master. Ah. Well, that would definitely be uh, why that that's going to be working then, huh? Okay. Let us continue. An intrigue perk. Ooh. So Court of Shadows. Disrupt scheme efficiency goes up. Prepared for anything. Yeah, I don't really need that. I think I might take Kidnapper. Because I think that might allow us to get another scheme against that child. Not that we necessarily needed it. But, you know. It might allow us to get that ex... Like... Yeah, it might work. Anyway. Uh, my time has come, my agent- the time has come, my agents are in place, one of them will pay the assassin the very night of the deed will happen, another will ensure the wall is unguarded, a third will leave a subtle trail of candles to, uh, Guardia's, uh, bedchamber. Everything is in place. Do it. Seems to have been difficult to get, uh, Guardia by himself, but once the assassin finally did, he was not long for the world. Heh. <laughs> Thankfully, my involvement in the crime remains unknown. I do love surprise visits. So we lose stress, uh, and if we have a look at this now, looking over at crew, and having a look at who's next in line, we have grandson followed by our like followed by um our son's wife, and then that's followed by our grandson, right? Let me just have a look here. That uh, is indeed followed by my grandson, who is a member of our dynasty. Oh. I didn't think the game was unpaused. That's fine. Greetings, Farron Didhu of Bassa. Two years ago, you promised to aid me in the Yatengian conquest. I didn't promise you anything. I promised your father, some, your grandfather something. Anyway, uh, of uh, Jamana of Cumbria. Yet you have done nothing to support me in this endeavor. What's the point of our alliance if you never even lift a finger to help me? Oh no, this AI is self-aware. And say, I will... Uh, Yes, I, I will send my troops immediately. Here's some gold, or I apologize. I should not have claimed that I would help. I will send my troops immediately. <sighs> well, let's raise our troops. Off you go on your journey. This really isn't what I wanted to be doing. Right, uh, I would like to kidnap your grandson. Are you okay with that? 
abduct. So we're only at 14%. Interesting. Hmm. Let me have a look here. So that's got a much different percentage on it than the other one. We get another 16 from inviting this person. It still only puts us at 30. Hmm. Okay, so we could do that. Or alternatively, we could try and mur We can't murder this guy because we can't murder him for another six years. We could try and abduct him. We're only at 5% there. Hmm. We might be out of things that we can do with that one. How about you? You're married to this uh, person. Okay, who now has a claim on uh, Yatanga. Okay, a pressed one. Uh, how far down the line are you? You're second in line. Wow. Well, 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 Mr. Five-Year-Old telling me I haven't been in any wars. I think it's time for you to have a little murder. There we go. Yeah. Please, come join me in this murder. Now, that's good. That That's some good stuff right there. I told you it was going to start steamrolling. And this is what I'm talking about. We have a potential crew. We have a potential Yatenga. Two things within our family already. That's not bad. Okay, right. Um, Who are you at war with? <laughs> Which one of these is yours? This one, right? Okay. There are a lot more of them. I think I might just suicide into them and then that'll work. Um... How do I even do this? What's your... How many defenders do you have? That's a few more than I have. I can't siege there. That's a large army that's dying. Um, is that the one that we're at war with? It is indeed. What about you? Where, where are you? I'm trying to find somebody who's maybe a little less... Uh, strong. How about this guy? How strong is your land? 200 troops. Okay, I think I just need to go up there and join a fight, I think. I don't think there's any other way of doing this. Yeah, I need to just go and chuck myself into a fight and then die, I think. That's probably our best plan. Yep. This might explain why the AI just randomly suicides. Maybe they're worried about not contributing. Ooh, murder en route. When the time comes, my agents will need a safe route to escape out of this guy's castle. I can pay some money get extra chance of killing. We did get Tattletail again, however the Tattletail again doesn't really matter because our chance of killing him is now 95. My honeycomb Gary uh, Yupla is, play is playing absent-mindedly with my hair as he tells me about my best hunting, about his best hunting kills. Though I know little of such things, I find myself mesmerized by his passion for the subject. His beautiful eyes are positively glowing and the deep insight behind his words is clear even to a novice like me. I think I could listen to him forever. So he can become our soulmate. A 50% chance that he doesn't feel the same way. Wait. Um, and just becomes a nov- And I become a novice hunter. Okay. Or, how interesting, can you explain that one more thing? Let's see if he'll become our soulmate. A declaration of love catches him off guard. His hand becomes still at my hair and I can feel his heart pound against my cheek. My own is beating just as hard. Is it true, did who? I have felt the same way for such a long time, but I never thought. The kiss which follows is the sweetest thing I have ever known. He has become our soulmate. Fantastic. Right, I'm now going to go and attack this army. Um, let's kind of suicide into it. Wait, which war is this? Is this the other war? It is. I really don't want to be attacked by that guy, because that would not help us. Yes, straight into battle. Yes, I, I am aware that I will lose decisively. I am aware. My quality is high, though. And I will die a brave man. Barely use trail. Kill him. He is dead. The child is dead. Our um, son's wife, so our daughter-in-law, now holds this land. Now, if they have a child, I'm just saying... We're going to get some land. It's expansion time. I mean, we won't get it. He'll get it, but still. Right, I believe I contributed to your war. Are you happy now? My war contribution is not zero. Uh, Yeah, see, I got 54 war contribution. It is 0%, but it is, con it is technically contribution. And that's what matters. Um... 
Yeah, I'm going to stick you in for our Chancellor role here. Just, I, yeah, I guess foreign affairs works. That's fine. Oh yeah, actually, I should mention, this is one of the few times where this is relevant. I don't know if they fixed it, but this used to not work when you were um, un when you were not an independent ruler. Like, it just didn't work. I mean, we also don't have any direct vassals of ours, so this is obviously the correct choice. But yeah, I thought that was interesting that we should probably just avoid pressing it. Anyway, that's fine. Neither of them really make a huge difference to us right now. Right. Contributed to the war. Waiting for our money to go up so we can buy a building. I think that we are in a good spot. We have a couple of different plates spinning. This is kind of like our main next one. Is trying to get rid of this child. Um, through whatever means. Oh, can we not abduct? Oh, because I cancelled the abduction scheme. We can't do it again. Oh. Oh. That's a bit stupid for me, isn't it? We could try marrying him. Although, wait a second. We'd need a daughter. Yeah. That, that's that's going to be the main issue there. But yeah, I think we're really close to getting our grandson in charge of crew, which would be great. And our grandson in charge of Yatenga. In fact, our grandson is going to be in charge of Yatenga if we get a grandson. So that'd be good. Okay, uh, what's this one? Uh, victory. We won. Well done us. Both Farin and Toki of Matt of man and I are held in esteem by our liege. However, when it comes to handing out titles, honour and wealth, one of us must always be first amongst equals. The upcoming gathering at Bisang du, uh, at Bisan Duju Castle gives me a chance to ensure that I'm the one with Farbass's favour. So, 52% uh, chance that we can become we get a weak for hook on him, get some prestige, um, and then he likes us. I can illustrate that Ama already favors me with a learning challenge. Oh, it's diplomacy learning. Whereas vassals, we should work together. Uh, I'll learning challenge him. Sure. I impressed him and got a hook. Wonderful. Oh, so we now have a hook on our leash. What, what's that do? Good question. That's okay. Oh, we do have a daughter. Oh, okay then. I completely missed that we have a daughter. Oops. Um... Maybe I could marry my, or betroth my daughter to, to this guy. Would you accept it? Probably not. That, that's a, that's a no. How about matrilineal? That, that's a real no, huh? Um, however, our daughter could marry the son of one of our lieges. Oh, sorry, of my liege. Like, one of the sons of my liege because uh, we have the hook, right? So we could say, this is going to happen. No, I'm sorry, I hooked it, so it will. Chance they inherit clubbed-footed, but it's unlikely that that's going to do anything. As in, it's unlikely that her family line is going to lead to anything. But it could be good. It could potentially lead to something. And it gets us an alliance with our liege, which is nice. So it means that nothing bad's going to happen there. Yeah, I think that's good. Yeah, I'm happy with that. We don't need to do anything crazy. We're not looking to... Uh, yeah, I'm not looking to do anything crazy, basically. Indiscreet counselor. Having safe, uh, served me faithfully as my court chaplain, I entrusted one lay with the ability to travel free, freely within my court. However, I've now learned he's taken advantage of my hospitality and has been indiscreet with my daughter. Oh, that is, that is not on. We are sadistic. I think it's time for us to uh, send him to jail, probably. So I can learn of their secret and say it's a great shame if it got out. In which case we get a hook. Or, on the other hand... Uh, I will imprison him. Yes. This is an act of tyranny? No. That's not an act of tyranny. This is an act of tyranny. There we go. Right, now he's dead. We have a new person, and hopefully they will be more inclined to not sleep with our daughter. Right, and I think that that's a good point to end the episode there. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.